ladies, my name is Heather Anderson of So Heather. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by today. So I upload two new videos every week. So be sure and subscribe to my channel if you love my videos, I'd really appreciate it. And also click the little bell notification so that you're sure not to miss any of my videos. So today I'm gonna to be sharing five fall date night looks. All are tastefully sexy. I feel like in the colder weather, maybe it's a little bit harder to dress, you know, in a sexy way for a date night. So I thought sharing these five fall looks that I think would be amazing to wear on a date night would be perfect for this time of year. I've actually got a few requests from you ladies to do some date night looks. So these again are geared towards fall, kind of the colder weather, but uh, let's get to it and dive right in. So date night look number one, is a faux fur jacket. This is a beautiful camel color. I think wearing faux fur is very sexy. I think it's very glamorous. I think it's very chic. I personally love to wear faux fur in the fall and winter and honestly wear it a ton. This jacket looks way more luxe. It looks way more expensive than it really is. It's extremely soft. Um, the price is around $130. So you know, I think it's quite a steal for such a beautiful jacket. There's a premium designer that makes a similar one that's like $1,000. So um, anyway, I think this is a great jacket. I think it is definitely sexy. Um, I paired it over this beautiful velvet top. I love this top because it does have sleeves. So being a little bit chillier in the fall and winter, if you wanted to shed your jacket while you were in the restaurant, you would still have this beautiful top on and your arms would be covered. This top is under $100. I love the colors, the rich golds and camels in this top. I think it's a beautiful top and for the price, it's just, you know, quite a steal and a no-brainer. So the pants I chose to pair it with are these uh, blank NYC faux leather joggers. So joggers aren't necessarily um, sexy, but I think they are if you pair them with heels and a beautiful sexy top. So. These faux leather joggers are extremely comfortable. They're very well priced. They're also under $100, so they're quite a steal. Um, I personally love them paired with heels, especially if you're going out on a date night or a girl's night out. But I also love them like worn on the weekend, super casual with some sneakers and a simple white tee and maybe a jean jacket. So highly recommend these joggers. And again, they're super, super comfortable. Um, of course, I paired them with heels because I feel like if you're going out on a date night or a girl's night out, by the way, ladies, all of these looks would be amazing to wear on a girl's night out too. I always, always, always wear heels. Even when I'm not on a date, you know, during the day when I'm going to meetings, um, you know, just getting dressed and going to lunch with my girlfriends or, you know, whatever. I feel more confident. I feel more myself when I wear heels, which is why I wear them, you know, like 90 5% of the time. So, you know, whatever that is for you, whatever you feel most confident and most comfortable in, wear that. But this is just what I'm recommending to wear when you're out on a date night. And so heels will definitely make you look tastefully sexy, but they will also make you look slimmer and they will make you look taller. So, hey, who doesn't want that? <laughs> okay, look number two that I think would be amazing to wear on a fall date night is this green Topshop cardigan, it's only $55. I love wearing olive green mixed with grays and golds and silvers. I think it's a beautiful color to wear in the fall and winter. This cardigan is comfortable. You know, mo you wouldn't think of a cardigan as being sexy, but I feel like if you pair it with some heels and some, you know, a pair of skinny jeans and a cami as I did in this outfit, it can be tastefully sexy, sexy and it can be worn on a date night. So I paired it with this Alice and Olivia black cami that also comes in white. This is actually a bodysuit. I love wearing bodysuits because they stay tucked in really well. Um, you don't have to worry about them bunching up or coming untucked, which is always nice. I recommended this bodysuit in my capsule wardrobe last week, so be sure and check out that video if you haven't already. I will link that in my description box below, as well as all of these items that I'm talking about, ladies, will be linked in my description box below, as well as the sizing information, just for a reference for you ladies. Um, but I love this cami, you know, it, it comes in black, it comes in white, in fact, it comes in several other colors. I have the black and the white and I wear them a ton underneath all of my jackets. I think the draping is beautiful. 
you know, it's a sexy cami, but it's done in a tasteful way. So highly recommend this bodysuit. Um, I paired this outfit with some black boots. So I think in the fall and winter, if you still want to look, you know, attractive and sexy to your partner, you know, wearing, maybe wearing a pair of open toe heels or even just regular pumps, it might be too cold. So I think, you know, putting on a pair of knee high boots with this look is a great way to still look look amazing, look tastefully sexy, but still be fairly warm. So I love these boots by Shoots. You know, knee-high boots are having a moment this season. I'll have to say I'm a huge fan. I love the heel on this boot. It's very, you know, it's very sexy, but it's also not like too crazy high. So these boots are actually fairly comfortable. I think the heel height's around three or three and a half inches. Um, these are, you know, black faux python. So they're absolutely gorgeous. They're a pretty reasonable price for such a beautiful boot. Um, I highly recommend these. I actually got these last year and I've already worn them a ton. And I know I'll be wearing these a ton as well this fall and winter. I also did a fall boot edit a couple weeks ago and I'll link that video below as well if you're wondering which boots you would love to add to your fall and winter wardrobe. All right, look number three is this cropped black blazer. So I love this blazer, ladies. Um, I love that it's cropped because it does a great job of looking, making you look taller and slimmer on five foot four. So I always wear sh jackets on the shorter side, um, you know, not 100% of the time, but most of the time. Um, this jacket is, you know, under $100. I love the brown tortoiseshell buttons on it. I think it makes this jacket actually look more expensive than it really is. Um, I paired it back with this um, rust-colored bodysuit from Shopbox that's also under $100. It's ribbed. It's sheer in the middle of the ribs, which I think makes it look very sexy, very chic, very polished. Again, it's a bodysuit, so it's going to stay tucked in very nicely. It's also going to have a slimming effect. This bodysuit also comes in black, and I'm actually thinking about ordering the black one because I wear black tops underneath all, a lot of my jackets most of the time. So love this bodysuit. I paired it back with the frame denim jeans that were part of my fall wardrobe capsule. These are the one pair of denim that I'm literally wearing the most this fall so far. I think I've worn them, I don't know, at least 20 times and I've only had them like two months. But these jeans are amazing. They're an ultra high rise, so they hit a little above your belly button. I love the edgy black wash. And they also do a great job of staying tucked into your boots, even ankle booties, because they're such a slender, you know, they're such a skinny jean and they're skinny on the ankles. So they're gonna do a great job of staying into your boots. So these are gonna be my number one jeans that I'm pairing with boots this fall and winter. Okay, look number four is the blank NYC snake print jacket. Now this is the one time that I have worn a longer jacket. Obviously I've worn longer jackets more than once, but in this series of five looks, this is the one longer jacket. So for you ladies that wanna cover the bum, you know, maybe you like a longer jacket because you're taller and you just feel more confident when you wear a longer silhouette, this is a great jacket. It's a snake print. It's a beautiful camel in black you know, tones, which I love, all of which are really big this fall. Um, this jacket is faux leather, but it's actually very soft. It's actually, to me, it's more like faux suede because it's really, really soft. Um, I think my style tip for this outfit is if you're going to wear something a little bit longer and a little bit oversized, always pair that with something fitted in form, you know, that's going to flatter your figure underneath it. So as you can see, I wore the same Alice and Olivia bodysuit with the slimming skinny jeans by frame to keep this look very, you know, very sleek, very sophisticated, very polished, but also very flattering. So again, when you wear an oversized coat or jacket, make sure you have everything underneath that is more, you know, form fitting to your body so that the jacket doesn't end up overwhelming you or overtaking your outfit. But love this whole look. I think it would be great for a date night or a girl's night out. And this jacket is a phenomenal price. It's actually under $100. So I think it's quite a steal for such a statement making jacket. I also want to mention with the several of these looks, I've had on this gold skinny Gucci belt. And I, this was also part of my fall wardrobe capsule. But this Gucci belt, I've only had it for about maybe six weeks now. And I've already worn it probably 20 times, I bet. I wear it with everything. I love the black and gold 
mixed with all these camels and rust colors that are so popular this fall and winter. Um, this skinny belt, I think, just adds the perfect amount of you know, polish to any look. If this is a little bit out of your budget, it's just under $300. I will link another one I found on the Nordstrom website that I love that's under $100. So I think adding a belt to any look is just the perfect way to finish it off. And it adds just a lot of, you know, a lot of chicness um, just very easily. So definitely recommend adding a belt to your looks, ladies. Okay, number five, this is another look that if you live somewhere that gets really cold in the fall and winter, this would be great to wear because it's paired with the knee-high boots from um, Tamara Mellon. These are a beautiful camel color. I featured these in my fall boot edit, which I will link for you ladies below, but these boots are extremely comfortable because they have a block heel and it's not uh, that high. It's about three and a half to four inches. I love this beautiful camel color. I've worn these boots a few times. I love it with just an all black ensemble as I've done here. So paired these boots back with the frame jeans, the skinny jeans that fit so nicely into these boots, along with, again, the Alice and Olivia bodysuit that I've worn, I think, in maybe three or four of these looks, proving its versatility, proving its wearability. So I believe in adding core basic pieces to your wardrobe, ladies, that you can wear over and over again with different looks. That way, if they are a little bit more expensive in the beginning, you know, you're gonna justify it because you're gonna be wearing these pieces over and over again. And if they're high quality, it's, it's okay, they're not going to wear out. So that's why I recommend maybe spending a little bit more on the basics so that you are able to wear them over and over again. And this Alice and Olivia definitely qualifies for an elevated basic that is a little bit more on the expensive side. I think it's 198, but well worth it because you're going to be wearing these camis underneath your jackets a lot. If you are, maybe if you're, if you're, you know, you live somewhere cold, you won't, well, then you don't need the cami. Maybe you want to do a, a, a V-neck cashmere sweater, which I included in my capsule wardrobe. So, you know, just kind of think about your lifestyle, think about where you live and what you wear most. For me, I live in Dallas, Texas, so it's pretty warm up until about November, December. So I do wear camis a ton underneath my jackets. Um, and then I paired it with an Alice and Olivia leather trimmed blazer. So I think a black blazer is also another wardrobe staple that every woman should own. I will link this exact one, which I love. I think it's a bit unique because it does have the leather trim on it. Um, it fits very nicely. It's very form fitting. Um, this blazer does run true to size. I love it worn with the sleeves pushed up. Um, you know, I just think this is, a, this is a great blazer and I love it paired with these beautiful black boots. So this would be a great date night look if you live somewhere a little bit colder. And of course, if you live somewhere really cold, you could just throw on a black teddy coat, a black long teddy coat, drape it over yourself over this entire look if you live somewhere really cold. So those were the five date night looks for fall. I hope you enjoyed this video, ladies. Please let me know in your description box. Um, below or in the comments below if you have any questions. I'm always here to help you ladies. Thank you so much for stopping by today and for more style information you can always head over to my blog soheather.com and on Instagram I am soheatherblog. You guys have a beautiful day and until next time I will see you soon. Bye-bye.